Fill those glasses with a bit of ice, love. I'm trying. Yeah, what well, by now I'll be whamming that on the table. Yep. We'll come back and put it. I'll refill the glass in a minute. Oh, that noise gets me every time. What, noise of ice in yeah, the freezer? Yeah, scrape in the freezer. Yeah, scrape it. It's like the blackboard, isn't it? It's worse than that. Hi, everybody. We're back. That's better. Yeah, that's better. Right. I can see everybody. Um, we're back because, well, you, you enjoyed the Floridora so much and it's still quite warm out. Um, we're on a cocktail roll, We're guys. on a cocktail roll. So I wanted to do this one for a while. It's a dead easy, simple recipe. It's one of the classics of all time. Um, yes, please, miss. I thought you said you are going to move the camera up so you could stand up because you're still, like, bent over. Oh, that's better. No, yeah, I can't. I'm just bending over because I feel like being closer to the... Closer to the I'm not sure hotel. they want you to be no. closer, but... Okay, we're going to do a Tom Collins. Professional boundaries. Yeah, it's all right. Be quiet. Go on, Tom Collins. Hi everybody, welcome to Cocktail Corner. We're going to do a Tom Collins. That was really bad, the intro, but that's what we're doing. Right. right. Dead simple. It's basically gin. We're going to use the high strength gin again. This woman's going to be drinking three of these, and they are kind of doubles, especially with the floor door as well. You have a sleep later? Yeah, I thought you might be. There's rugby on the telly later. She can have a sleep. I've got a day off tomorrow. That's true. You're going to need one. We need uh, gin. We need sugar syrup. Um, we need some citrus juice. Which one have we got? A lemon. Lemon, well done. Juice of a lemon. And we need some club soda, which is basically soda water. Okay, to all intents and purposes. I did actually look it up just in case, but yeah, club soda is soda water. Yep, just fizzy carbonated water. Remember the old days? Do you know, I remember recently, well, not so recently. That's I those funny tops you can't take off. No, I ate that. But we've been here, what, eight years now? Mm -hmm. And before we moved here, one of my very, 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 very best friends from school, whenever I went to visit her, which was often, she always had a bottle of wine. Right. But we always diluted it with soda water. Yeah, because that makes it kind of spritzer. Yeah. yeah. Not like lemonade or anything, yeah. but soda water. That was the first intro to soda water I had. There you go. My first intro was I had a big black Labrador once and I took him out and fed him. He was hot, so we needed to get a drink and we had to get Perrier water from the garage. There you go. Right. Perrier ain't the same as soda though. Well, it, well, I reckon it is. I reckon it's that same kind of minerally thing going That's on. That's why I don't like fizzy Yeah, fizzy, fizzy minerally thing. No. Well, you're going to have to like them today because well, you've got gin in them. So well, that makes everything better. Gin makes everything, <laughs> makes everything better. better. 50 mils of dry gin, please, or whatever gin you got. 50 mils. No, notice that there is no cocktail shaker this time because I think there isn't? You, no because you saw the other recipe the one you were still part of your way through I said you're not really supposed to shake gin okay so it just goes in the glass you'll need something to kind of I don't need a swizzle spoon aren't I uh, probably yeah all right 50 mils of gin 25 mils of lemon juice which you reckon is what I reckon it's probably about um yeah uh, it's not it's a bit less than a lemon <laughs> Oh, lemons are, really. Yeah, it does. Um, 25ml of on. sugar syrup. Hang on. Better mop that a bit anyway. Dear me. You, you can't get the staff, <laughs> honestly. You really can't. Well, it was, it was her idea to do another recipe today, and I said, probably not, but go on then. Wing it, boy, wing it. Okay, 25 mils of sugar syrup. We're using Monin. You can make your own. Um, we'll probably do a tiny little stupid video about how to make sugar syrup, but basically it's sugar and water boiled up and then cooled. It is, and it's probably a lot cheaper than this, especially if you can put it into a bottle. Although I guess then you get into the thing of like, oh God, you have to sterilise the fucking bottles and all that business. Well, that's where we're then, though. No, I said... Yeah, yeah. She's going back to her Irish peck, honestly. Right, uh, 125 mils of chilled soda water. I'll check on the edit, and if it's that bad, I'll put a bleeper in. What a surprise. I don't gin, gin's not good for you. I'm I don't you. need bleepers. So 125 mils of soda water, which basically just knocks it all back. 50. Yep. 100. Yeah, and the other end. Well, we'll just be in that, really. That's fine. 25. Put a bit more ice in that. It's supposed to be a high one. There just you go. Nick my, my ice cream on my next one. That's all right, we got, we got plenty. Good Give it a little stir around. And that is a Tom Collins. Swizzler. Gently stir it, don't disturb it too much. 
don't disturb it too much. You have to disturb it a bit, otherwise all If you disturb it too much, it's the same as if you're shaking the gym. I'm not, I'm not shaking, I'm Gently gently, caress it. I'm gently stirring, gently. Well done. So that is a Tom Collins, but we have a few of these left from the Flora Dora recipe we did. Yeah. So, get yourself a glass. Are we not going to taste that one? No, we're going to put both together. Right. Right, okay. Get yourself a glass. Oh, you've nicked half the ice, haven't you? I have, but that doesn't matter. Because you're going to have to... Uh, yeah, that's on, probably. Right. So you need to muddle a few raspberries in the bottom. And now only, he says the like... The only difference yeah. is you're going to put a few raspberries in the bottom and you're going to muddle. Hang on, I get me muddler. Go get me muddler. You could use a hefty spoon, to be honest. Yeah, but why use a hefty spoon? As you've, got, got, a, as you've got a root device, you might as well use it. Yeah, squeeze your up. Get yourself a bit more ice. Oh, it squelches. To squelch? Well, it would. It's, it's yeah. Why not? Yeah. Fine. Um, you're going to need yourself another uh, lemon, same as you did before. And it's exactly the same recipe, but it's with a raspberry Collins, so it's got a fresh raspberries in it. I think we might need another couple of ice cubes. That's right. I'll sort that out. You undo another lemon. I'll do the lemon. And we'll do, do a build. Cubes. Okay. So same again. 25 mils of lemon juice. Let's try and get it right this time. Yeah. That's just safer to do that, isn't it? Fine. 50 mils of uh, gin. Our little measure is basically a 15 and 25, if you didn't know that already. 50 Lovely. gin. Yep, 25 mils of sugar syrup. God, I'm getting hot. You won't be happy drinking these, well, you probably will be happy drinking these. Sugar syrup. Yep, and 125 mils of club soda. We've only got bits of lime, we'll put the lime on that one. Lovely. There we go. Give that a little bit of a stir around as well. Lovely. That one looks pretty. It does look pretty. One of those. Cut a fresh raspberry on the top. It's like a gatto. Like a gatto, yeah. And um, you have a normal Tom Collins and you have a raspberry Tom Collins okay or a raspberry Collins depending on how you feel right. we'll take photographs of these very quickly and we're going to then give a taste okay but in all tastes you start with the original because that might be a bit different okay I'm just going to stir it a bit because it looks like the lemons on the top you might have sat a bit do you well I could just see lemon on okay. the top so this is just so if you like refreshing gin really yep perfect yeah perfect for a long hot summer's day which is what we yep. got today i think it's touching nothing fancy degree. no nothing fancy that's the point of this one excellent for a straw i'd say yeah and it's very different to a gin and tonic yeah absolutely which you think it's quite similar but it's not no like that like the citrusness that comes out of it even with the really strong gin yeah very good and i'll see why it's a classic See, now that you could do with a straw, but you ain't going to do a straw with this. No. You get stuck with your um, straw, with your Another recommendation bits. with this, I would say, is if if you've got loose dentures, be careful with this one, because you have a few little seeds under your plate, you oh know? Oh my God. Go on, give them a try. <laughs> the other way you could do it is, you could just muddle it maybe in a, in a cocktail shaker and then strain out the bits, so you just have the, the raspberry juice. But it's fresh raspberries, so it's not going to be a sweet thing. Mm. Better, not better. Mm. Different. Different. Well, yeah, that's the point. There are lots of different versions of Collins. We're going to do a few more um, when planes don't go over, and we don't. Well, we won't be doing it today. That's for sure. But we've got a few more of these to do. There's so many. It's nice, but it's not so. Um, it's not as defined as that, if you know what. Yeah. I mean almost a raspberry almost makes it messy 
like it makes it messy in the drink, but also makes it messy in its taste. Yeah. It's um, it's obviously sharper, drier, because relatively dry. They're not, they're not like sweet like a strawberry. You would probably want more sugar in that. You're the sort of person who puts sugar on strawberries when you have them fresh, so. No, I don't think it needs more yeah. sugar. It's just very different. Okay. It's so, the sort of thing that if you have raspberries. Still go on, yeah, go on. Then by like, like and you needed to use them or whatever. <laughs> oh, you get violent after a drink as well. Stop. Then, yeah. Yeah. But if you want like just pure, and you don't want to mess around with much stuff. Unadulterated, go for that. Yeah, if you've got some soft fruit around, use it. Like I said, there are lots of different versions of this. To literally the same base, but different alcohols. Yeah. So we will do a couple more because a couple I would like. There's mm -hmm. a couple of whiskey kind of bourbon based ones we're going to do on another video. Not today though. Today it's all Not about today. the gin. It's all about the gin. Thanks for watching everybody. Please subscribe. Please hit the notification bell. Come and join me on Big Eye Golf. Kelly and I on Big Eye World. And we'll see you all very soon. Um, Kelly can have a few drinks and a sleep. Yes. And watch rugby. Come on England. Hopefully. Um, by the way, I think you probably have already recognised that you don't come here for perfection. You come no, here you for just come fun. here for a good drink, a bit of a laugh. Come for fun. Absolutely. See you Bye, bye everybody. Bye.